Welcome back to my channel where we are all angels. To become one of Cherisee's angels, subscribe and hit the bell icon for notification updates on my lifestyle, my beauty, my passion for fashion, and of course more. Stay tuned and follow all of my social media accounts in the description box below and be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to share and give a big thumbs up to show your love and support. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy my channel. So without further ado, Let's get into it. Cherisee. What's up, Cherisee's Angels? What's the deal? Welcome back to another video. You see the fit of the day? Don't play with me. You know what I'm saying? It's Pink Friday. Every Friday, every Wednesday, we wear pink every day. You hear me? But so today is going to be a day with me. <laughs> I know y'all. I know y'all been waiting for this. <laughs> I know y'all been waiting. So here I am to tell you, we going on a trip and our baby wagon shit going through the sky, little Einstein. That's where we going. Going on a little trip in my little rocket ship, and that's period. Yeah. So I'm about to show y'all this fit, and then let me know if I should wear this headband with this. Or not. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Attention, like to my background. But you see the fit my D K N Y beat you up. But um, my all pink, my all pink. It's giving Pink Panther with a little iridescent. I didn't know if I wanted to wear slides, which I did want to wear slides. It's just raining outside. But y'all see the iridescent? Like, should I go get them? And like. Add this to it. I think that's so cute. <laughs> right? Ain't it cute? Or is it like too much for the fit? Because you see the air that's in my shoe. So I'm like, <laughs> they might think like, who, the, who did it and why? But it's so cute though. Let me know in the comments below. Okay. I know you hear it. I really should drop my seatbelt on, but I, I don't. But I, I, should, I definitely should. Especially since it's rainy. But, mm, okay, good. Um, so right now, I just got done getting my nails done. It's the ombre color. You kind of can't see it. I can't see it right now. But um, I got my nails done. Uh, it was my first time getting powder and ombre. So if you missed that self care uh, maintenance video, sorry, my voice just cracked. Self care maintenance video, go back and watch it for me, please. So you can um, see how to get treated, be treated, and treat others. Okay. But, um,. <laughs> So yeah, I just got done getting my nails and feet done, you guys, for the day. And I went home, changed into something cuter. You know what I'm saying, Pink Friday. Why am I saying Pink Friday and it's Saturday? That don't even make sense. <laughs> I keep saying Pink Friday. Friday was yesterday, May 18th. I don't really know the day. I'll let you know soon. But, um. No, I'm lying. Today is like the 22nd, May 22nd. I'm lying. Um, so anywho, I'm about to go get a, I'm about to look for some athletic tape because if you're not new here, then you would know from my new car tour video that I've been uh, in previous accidents. So I definitely have back injuries, my spinal, um, is out of my spine is out of place in my spinal cord <laughs> I was gonna say my spinal cord my 
my spine is out of place. So um, when I was at the chiropractor, they used everything. They got me. They got my ass for all my money, literally. They used everything. And I need that. So, like, they use this black um, tape. And I and I know it's athletic tape because I see athletes wear this tape and like the benefits. Oh, child, I need that, especially when I'm working. Um, when I'm working all day, standing on my feet, or just period. I need some black tape, and I've been meaning to do this for like a year. I don't know, like six months actually, and I just have not done it. And so I was at the nail shop watching this because they had the uh, sports channel on and oh my god that's the car ball. I let a car got them thinking got every day for it but I definitely want that uh, S5 automatic but just so I can you know wrap that bitch at first I didn't want to but now I'm like my am but um like I was watching this uh, sports channel, you guys, and it was crazy because it had to be foreign because I was really confused, like on what sport it was. Cause like you know how like we play football and we like play football with we throw it with our hands and like in what Africa or another country they play soccer or they call it football. You know like what I'm talking. You know what I'm trying to say. And so, but it's like backwards. It's like different. This was backwards twisted like up down fucking inside out like i don't know what type of sport this was what they made this into but they was using a soccer ball and they was using their hands they wasn't using their feet like they only used their feet to kick it one time just to kick it further down the field just to get it closer to their goal but that's the only time they was using their hands with the soccer ball but it wasn't even like a soccer ball it was kind of oval shaped and it wasn't all the, it wasn't like a football you know what I'm saying? It was like, I would say, hey, Arnold's head, but his head is shaped like a football. But, like, it was more oval than that. It wasn't, that, like, as sharp on the edges. And so they was just throwing the ball, tackling each other. Like, I don't know, seeing their plays and just, I was like, what the, f what, <laughs> what is this? <laughs> because, what the fuck is this? And I came up with this new sport that's, already two different sports in one they mixed it and made it one sport soccer and football it looked it's shaped like a football but it's the outside exterior of it is a soccer and then they're using their hands to throw it but it's not they're not throwing it like a football they're just tossing that bitch like good throws like you know what I'm saying good throws as if he was like on a basketball court and they're not even as sharp as that so I'm like and you know it's foreign. Oh, yeah, I got something in my eye. You know it's foreign because there's a whole bunch of foreigns on there. And I'm like, what the fuck is this? But, anyway, <laughs> they had the, they all, I seen that they all had the um, black tape on their legs. And I was like, oh, yeah, I'm on it. I'm on it. I'm about to go to Dick Sporting Good. And I pray that they got it because why wouldn't they? It's Dick Sporting Good. And if they don't have it, I guess I'll go to Academy Sports. But Academy Sports is after me. Sporting good, so I would assume the sporting good would have it. And you know, it's probably gonna be more expensive, but it's whatever. So I'm hungry and it's food this way anyway. And I didn't want to go the other way because people cannot fucking drive in the rain. Hello, you can't drive, stay at home. Um, so yeah, so yeah, that's what I'm about to do, y'all. I'm about to go get this uh, athletic black tape for my bag. Oh, and let me tell you why, though. Let me tell you why. It's six, God damn. <laughs> let me, I just be talking. Let me tell you. Let me tell you why I'm in so much pain right now. <laughs> because when I get bored, y'all, I, I like to. Okay, let's be real. I like. I teach myself everything. Okay, I'm just that bitch. I teach myself everything. I like to improve my skills in a lot of areas. And one area I really want to improve in is um boxing and i mean and i don't mean like street fighting like that's yeah you're gonna improve you know regardless but um 
boxing, like the footwork and the combinations. So I be teaching myself that shit. I just need to go pay for a personal trainer, but I ain't got time for that. I ain't got time for the fucking egos and men and just uh, when I'm ready to do that, I do that. I really want to go to fucking Thailand, like and just put in work, <laughs> like Demi Lovato did. <laughs> I want to go to Thailand, learn some mixed martial arts. But before I learn mixed martial arts, I got to get the boxing down, like, down and packed. You know what I'm saying? Like, got to get the boxing and then the mixed martial arts. And it's like the taekwondo. Taekwondo. Yeah, I'm trying to learn all that shit. Fuck, is you talking in this little brick? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm trying to learn all that shit. I don't even talk about it. I don't even talk about it. So, yeah, um... Oh, <laughs> what was I getting to? My point here. My point is, my ass. I'm I'm so late. I'm not hit to the uh, YouTubers versus TikTok TikTokers uh, boxing match or press conference and all that shit. I'm so late. I'm just now tuned into that shit on DDG play on DDG um, YouTube channel. Yo, that shit got me. That shit had me dying fucking week like. Dying week, but but before before I even say that, I've always just like at random when I get bored, train myself and just like you know play around. So when I seen that they was like sparring and playing around, but serious, I'm like you know I caught a vibe. I really caught a fucking vibe, and my ass is over here fucking sparring and training with them. <laughs> and yo, what the fuck? Why the next? in a bitch like it's like <laughs> I ain't never had to do that I'm like yo why did I why did I even do that to myself like I'm sitting over here playing it's always happen when I be playing I always be playing like play like playing like I'm squatting or or I be twerking and my ass be sore the next fucking day literally sore as shit like, like a whole workout so now I really need this. I had to put some icy hot patches right here on my arms <laughs> everywhere because I'm so sore. I was putting in that work. <laughs> like I was in the ring with them. <laughs> and so I got to go get this um tape, y'all, because I'm fucking in pain. And this, like, you want to know how I keep my, um, y'all probably really want to know my fitness journey. And I'm going to have to give y'all that story time another day. But after like all of like after my fitness journey the only thing i do to keep up with myself is eat healthy you know what i'm saying work out from time to time which i don't work out i be fucking playing around and then it turns into a workout and i be like oh my god why did i do that to myself like i was just playing and now i'm like sore sore as fuck like i did a whole cardio workout it's ridiculous so yeah yeah Take y'all with me. See y'all in Dicks. So I just made it to Dicks. Let me just say one thing before I get out the fucking car. If you pull up next to somebody who has a nice car or if it's a Humpty Dumpty, take your fucking time and be conscientious of how far apart you are from the car and the damn door when you swing it open. Because look, I'm not about to like penalize everybody for a little mark on my car, but at the same time, Bitch, it's a fucking problem. Like, I'm not about to let everybody keep putting marks on my shit because you think you better than me because you fucking Caucasian. No, I'm not doing that. So, if you think you better than me because of your skin color, bitch, you not. Calm that shit down. Chill out. Chill out. Because that shit's fucking mad annoying. It's fuck. Like, motherfucker, we work for our fucking shit. We work hard for our shit. Okay? We are value. We are the mother, we are the number one fucking value. You pay for our body parts. Stop fucking playing with me. All right, so now that I got that off my chest, we're about to go inside. And it's fucking pouring down. Excuse my language. I'm going to stop cussing on here for real, for real. But at the same time, y'all going to have to get used to it because it, it's really no harm. Like, it's really not that big of a deal. I don't know why people be acting like shit is. Okay, we're good. I was being a little over dramatic. It's okay. Gotta be over dramatic sometimes.
Thank you so much for helping me. Yeah, not a problem. Um, your total is going to be 1086 today. Okay. And should be ready for you on there. Would you like a bag for these? Uh, yeah, I'll take one. Okay. Why not? next purchase of 50 for taking it um if, and if you wanted to my name is mercedes if you mentioned that at the end of the survey okay it'll help me out a lot here at the store yeah, and then that uh coupon will be just emailed to you you can use it anytime you come back in it doesn't okay. have an expiration oh perfect thank you You're welcome. Have a nice day. you too see you later <laughs> oh you know i work at Kid trip when i say see you later <laughs> bye this black man opened the door for his woman when they came to the car you don't, I don't like, you don't usually see that nowadays, like, and they're grown, but you just don't see that shit, like, there's no morals, no values, or respect in this generation, and there hasn't been since the 90s, like, let's be real, since the hip-hop culture came, everything, every nigga has just been foul fucking play, foul, they ain't got no fucking respect, no fucking morals, like, and the shit is ridiculous, like, and it, and if they ain't got it, the men in the next generations will never have it, so who's gonna teach it to you, because niggas don't listen to their grandpas, apparently, and the daddies that they running around with ain't no better, so niggas' daddies nowadays is just fuck no nah. you can't even depend on a parent to like call the shots like tell their kid when they wrong because their parents just be trying to still be young like get your old ass on somewhere and go make something of yourself still 50 years old you could make something of yourself you could still become a legend what you running around trying to act like a 30 year old for i don't understand that like man be tripping <laughs> tripping like when you could literally have a wife a happy wife and a happy life and you could have a woman behind you um following you following your lead if you're a good leader as well as you being a good leader knowing when to delegate you know you feel me Tyrese good shit <laughs> I always wanted to say that as being a good leader knowing when to delegate <laughs> Like I just popped something up. <laughs> Shit. But anywho, I'm at Best Buy, so I'm about to go in here and get um a case for my uh iPad. And then I'm about to get something to eat. And I'm calling it a motherfucking day for me. Like I do have other shit I could be doing, but I'm tired and I don't want to let nobody mess up my energy and my uh peaceful day that I've been having. It's been somewhat peaceful. So yeah, I'm gonna let y'all come with me. Thank you. 
location. So we're looking for a cake. I don't have nothing to do. Spectacular. Okay, so I'm going to Amazon. I don't have no colors I want. Well, this is probably the only color. Oh, it's clear? Oh, okay, this is cute. But it's $40. And is this Uh, 2019, 2020. Is this even for mine? I'll let y'all know. Okay, so they did not have the iPad case that I need because I need the iPad 2021 11 or 10.9 inch, and they didn't have it. So I'm gonna just uh order me a case off of Amazon. But I did find something. You, it's a clip on ring light, works with most mobile devices. Most, but they got a picture of an iPhone, so I would assume it's gonna work with mine. This is perfect. This is what I need because who wants to carry a big ass ring light around with them all the time? Not me. This is exactly what I need. And then I got me a suction cup, so um. I don't have to be holding my phone in my car. Y'all just going to see me. And it's magnetic. And the dude that um suggested this one said he already, like, practiced with his uh, phone. And then said that it doesn't come off. So, we going to see. So, those are my two little purchases from Best Buy. And it was pretty pricey. I'm not going to lie. The magnet was... Or the... um suction cup was $29.99 and then the clip on ring light was $9.99 actually it really wasn't that bad but still I'm investing in myself and you guys it's a scary feeling I'm not gonna lie it's a pretty scary feeling like you know you could really go broke investing in yourself and I'm not trying to do that not at all but because I've already done that so I can't do it again um, it's a scary feeling, but I know God is on my side, so we're gonna make it work. And with that being said, I'm about to get something to eat. I'm gonna catch y'all when I get something to eat, and then you're dead, you're done. No, I'm kidding. But I'm really about to be done for the day. Because it's a rainy day. And I'm really hungry. Don't know what I want, but I know I'm hungry. So I'm about to call some food in somewhere. And I'll see y'all in another day. thing. Don't mind my part. I know that shit is a little jagged. But I'm working on it. I don't know what it is with me and these parts. I just be quick with the shit. I don't even be trying to make it, like, perfect. But I need to because... I can't keep neglecting things like my lips. <laughs> Hi. There you go. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> So before I close out this video, I definitely wanted to make sure I got back and told y'all it is Saturday, May 22nd, 522, period. And also treat others the way you want to be treated. And I'm about to show y'all my food. I'm about to show y'all my food. 
I got me some blackened seasoned fries. They look dry because I was like 20, 20 minutes late. My order was done 20 minutes ago. I'm only showing y'all this because I really got a pee. Yo. Hold on. It's already getting messy. See that? Oh shit, y'all. I got a piece so bad. I've been holding it. So, y'all see the food? I got me some celery, some ranch. I would do a mukbang, but if you want to see this wing mukbang, go to my very first video uploaded. My very first wing mukbang. And you're going to see that one. And if you want another one, let me know in the comments below. But I have to use the restroom and I have to um, go eat and call it a day for right now because it's muggy outside and I've had a long day. So nothing too exciting, but in my book, it, this food is the exciting part. So, and I know y'all probably want to see a mukbang, but again, if you want to see one, comment down below or go check out my other ones and that's period so i'm about to end this in this date with me vlog and i hope y'all have a blessed day you know what i'm saying stay up keep your head up high and yeah much love make sure you like comment and subscribe. okay so i'm at dairy queen i've been sitting in this line forever i got here at 9 40 left my house at 9 30 and it's 10 51 and i still ain't even ordered y'all It's okay because I'm getting my favorites. And I'm sorry. All right, finally. Thank you for stopping at Dairy Queen. The blizzard of the month is the drumstick or the brownie batter. We'll be with you in the just a moment. The brownie batter. Should I do it? Um, a deer cream muffin and try the different summer blizzard flavors. Thank you for stopping at Dairy Queen. I can help you out. Are you ready? Um, can I have a medium cotton candy blizzard with extra everything? That's like weird. I'm sorry. Can I have a medium cotton candy blizzard with extra everything? With extra what? Cotton candy in the syrup. Alright, what else? And then just a medium water. Sorry? A medium water. Alright, what else? That's it. Bye, baby. Take me to go the window. Thank you. Thank you. Why she can't hear? Do I even have my uh, credit card? That's the question. <laughs> I got it. Thank God he turned that card. It was so loud. That's why she can't hear me. Okay. He's in his car. It's really been a long way, y'all. Like, I'm sorry. And they closed at 10 o'clock. It's 9.54. Ain't nobody else in line, though. Because they cut the line.
the bullshit I was waiting on. The foolery. But if it was black people doing it, the cop that was rolling by would have said something because he kept rolling by. Like, boy, please, you know you're not. Finally, my turn. Thank you. Right, we all ready to go. <laughs> 'Cause you're doing tripping. Worried about these other people. Give me my shit, bro. And get and come correct. Okay. I'm about to start snapping on people and I swear to God, look, you're not looking. Pay attention. The fuck. Looking at me, bitch. What? Your fat ass and stuff. Being rude. Cause I would get the going. Being rude. Cause I would get the going. Have a good night. You don't even mean that. Hey, child. <laughs> I tried to end it on a good note, child, with a little Dairy Queen ice cream dessert, you know, for the end of the night. And then that little girl had a little attitude. Like, I know you're having a long day, hard day at work, but damn, like, when somebody comes in with like with a refreshing energy, like supposed to take that in bitch don't knock me the fuck is you doing so i'm definitely not trying to knock nobody nobody's weight nobody's nothing but i was that was just a little in the moment and she was telling me kept telling me to have a good night and bitch you don't even mean that the fuck is you doing like hell nah keep that shit to yourself i don't give a fuck about you have a good night bitch give me my credit card how about that give me my money and i will have a good night come correct lose the attitude and i will have a good night no nah. Have a good night regardless. So y'all have a good night and see y'all in the next video. So real good in every hood. Pull up to your nigga. Hood huh, looking real pretty. Pull up to your nigga city. Looking real pretty. Looking real pretty. Looking real pretty. Spoil me. Now he come back. Ass getting fat. I know he want it back. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, now cut. Cut it. <laughs> As you can see. I am a walking angel, but a spoiled brat. So subscribe to my channel if you want to join the pack. <laughs> nah, but for real. See you in the next video. Much love. Cheersy.